Hi everyone, Tom Hill here from Guelph Hyundai. I'm standing with our very cool new 2022 Santa Cruz. This is a brand new vehicle for us and a brand new segment for us as well. As you can see, our front end here is uh, kind of heavily based on our 2022 Tucson. However, it looks a little more aggressive than what the Tucson does, having these more blocky DRLs here. So these are our daytime running lamps. Uh, just like the Tucson's, they, they just look like they're part of the grill when they're off. However, when they're on, it's, uh, it's a very cool look. Up front as well, of course, being a Hyundai, we have tons of safety features in this vehicle. Down here is our radar for our adaptive cruise control, as well as our uh, forward collision warning. We have our camera right here as part of our 360 degree panoramic setup. Up in the windshield, we do have our camera there and that's gonna be used for things like our lane keep assist. And again, things like leading vehicle departure warning. So a lot of great safety features from Hyundai. Coming around to the side here, it is sitting on these very cool looking 20 inch rims and we, they are wrapped in Michelin Primacy tires. Again, we have this plastic cladding around here and a cool little Easter egg as we do have a little Santa Cruz kind of embossed into the plastic there. Very cool little detail. Coming around to the side of the vehicle, again, a lot like the 2022 Tucson, we have some polarizing lines throughout the entire vehicle. So this is the vehicle's belt line here, and then it kind of expands into the front. Now on the side as well, we have our, uh, our cameras for not only our 360 degree view, but our blind view monitor as well, which Hyundai has now been putting in a lot more of our vehicles and it is a fantastic safety feature. Coming around to the back is one of the biggest things of this vehicle would be the, uh, the bed of the vehicle. So this is a four foot bed with a built in standard tunnel cover. So this sliding tunnel cover comes standard with this vehicle. It's also a slow, uh, slow loading uh, tailgate for us as well. And when clicking that, a little push forward and it retracts completely. And as you can see here, I have this strap. It's easy enough to pull and lock back into place. And it is actually completely lockable. So if I do that, close it up, I can no longer get in. Now hidden underneath is actually another compartment here. So under here, this is actually uh, just, it's waterproofed as well. So we have our seals around here. And if we look over here, we actually have a drain plug right in the bottom corner there. So yes, it can be filled with ice and, uh, and you can put all sorts of soda inside of this and then drain it out at the end. Now as well in the tailgate here, we have lots of storage areas and another big one is an actual three prong wall plug there. We also have another storage compartment opposite this one, just on the other side here. And this one is just a, a normal storage uh, storage compartment there. So a little cubby for, uh, for any items that you'd wanna keep in the back here, toe straps or anything like that. We also have our lights here that can be activated from inside the vehicle, so they're LED lights. And as you can see, we have our little window here as well. So that's not power sliding, but it is a manual sliding window. So it's still a very nice additional feature. We also have our side steps here. And of course, big news for this vehicle is the powertrain. So underneath the hood is a 2.5 liter turbo. That is the only engine exclusively for the Canadian market is a 2.5 liter turbo and all wheel drive. So this vehicle has 281 horsepower and a massive 311 pound feet of torque. So not only is it quick using our eight speed dual clutch transmission, it's, it's a very, very quick vehicle, but it can also do a lot of towing. So this guy's actually available up to uh, 5,000 pounds of towing. Our bed as well, our payload is in and around that 1,700 pound mark. So, you know, a trip to Home Depot or, or anything of that nature over to the garden center, it can be easily done with this vehicle. Around to the other side, of course, matches our other side of the vehicle. And it's just an overall beautiful design now lastly, something I didn't touch on the front is where our headlights are in this vehicle. Now this is a very uh, Hyundai focused design. We, we do this with a lot of our vehicles, Palisade, Tucson, the Kona was actually the original one that started it and it's the split headlamp design. So these are our daytime running lights, as I had said, and then these are our, um, our high beams and our regular headlights there and they're dual projection LEDs. So super powerful lights. Just a moment, I'll pop the hood and show you what it looks like underneath. Of course as well, I can remotely start the vehicle right from the fob, which I will show you after I show you what it looks like under the hood. So 
So just like any other Hyundai vehicle, it's very uh, it's very simple under the hood here. It's not overly complicated, and that's something I love about this brand. We keep it simple. For example, our 10 second air filter change, something I always love to show off. Two clips, pull out your air filter, throw it out, grab a new one, slide in, clip, clip, down. Super easy, super simple. And like I said, 2.5 turbo under the hood, tons of power readily available. So like I said, built-in remote start, lock, hold down our remote, vehicle is good to go. As you can see on the fob here, there's also a button that you hold down and will actually drop the rear tailgate for you. All right, folks. That's our look at the 2022 Hyundai Santa Cruz. They should be landing very shortly. If you want one, reach out to us. We're more than happy to help out. Again, that was Tom Hill, 2022 Santa Cruz. Thanks a lot.